Hi guys, it's Lily. I'm a full-time reseller on Poshmark and I am back. I just did a jewelry unboxing and I swear I was so monotone, so tired from... I just got my car fixed. It's hot. I waited out and the... I didn't think I was going to fix it today. I, they were just supposed to look at it, but I ended up sitting in the garage watching them fix my car in 95 degree heat. So, like, as soon as I got home, I hurried up and did the jewelry, and I, so, I don't, didn't seem too, um, excited about it, but I got some really good pieces, so that'll be uploading, um, here, I don't know, no, before or after this one, we'll see. This is the name brand handbag box I got from Trudette, and it also came from Swanee, Georgia, as did the jewelry, and... I'm going to guess there's a Marc Jacobs bag in here because this box is heavy. And when I set it down on the floor, all I heard was hardware. So there's something in here heavy with hardware. Don't know what that might be. There we go. Um, what was it? I forget that not everybody that watches the resellers. So $100 plus tax. So, what did I say? $22. So got $22 per piece cost of goods for me. And it should be four handbags and an accessory. Oh, we have another box. Oh, this is cute. I think this says Kate Spade. Let me see. Yeah, Kate Spade. Got some issues already, I see. Um, I don't know if you can see. If I can even figure out how to open it. <laughs> don't break it, Lily. Don't break it. Oh, you just do this. Okay. Well very pretty inside it's just a clutch it's very clean uh, zippers clean one two three four five six uh, nice card slots and this is very clean and it's clean on the outside what I do see is I'm not sure how I'm gonna get it but I'll figure it out it's almost like they spilled Coke. I don't know if you can see. See all that in, in here, and here, and down in here. Other than that, uh, it's it's beautiful inside and out. It's almost like a satin linen because it has these little looks like runs, but they're not runs. They're supposed to be in the fabric like that. Linen is kind of like that. Okay. Nice. Kate Spade. Mm -hmm. Okay. Might this be the heavy hardware one I was in? Maybe. And it is heavy. <laughs> it's a Rebecca Minkoff. I should have known that by the tassel, huh? She's the only one that does the tassels on everything. Um, hardware is very heavy. I guess you can to expand it, drop it down. There is a zipper pocket here. This really pretty blue polka dot lining, and that is clean on that side. It does have some couple little pen marks and it does have some you can see this here transfer like from hitting against jeans maybe I'll work on that it does have the crossbody strap which is good and it's in good condition and the inside is in good condition it just needs a good wipe down the outside on the other hand, needs some work. There's a little bit of wear. 
um, but not bad. Overall, good. I think it's good overall. Okay. I think that was probably the heavy one. Nice. Metallic. Michael Kors. I call it a hobo bag. I don't know what you guys call it. Um, wow, lots of pockets. One, two, three, four. Five, six. I have a bag similar to this in a different color, I think. Um, yeah, this is nice. Does have the key. The interior is not bad. I will still clean it, but it is not bad. It has a zipper, two slide ends there, and two more slide ends on this side. This is a nice bag. Let me look at the bottom. It has a little bit of wear where the hardware is, but not really. I mean, you know, just, just a little. And with silver metallics, kind of hard to uh, match that with anything, but it has a few. I don't know if that's leather worn. I'll have to look at it a little bit better. Um, I don't know if that will clean off or. I don't know. I'll look at it. It's a beautiful purse. Nice and heavy. If it doesn't clean off and I can't get a good price for it, I will probably keep this one because it's like a perfect fit here. I like that. Okay. Nice. Not bad. All right. What we have here? Another Kate Spade. Um... Please tell me the crossbody's in here. Yes. Does have this crossbody. And it's in good condition. Yay. All right. This just needs to be cleaned up and conditioned. I could probably color match that if I needed to. That pocket is good. like the inside is navy so this is a really cute color combination so it's got two sliding pockets on one side a zipper pocket on the other you can carry it I don't think it'll be a good shoulder no just carry it like this or crossbody so that's also nice I can clean that out. yeah oh guess what I got <laughs> Another pair of Kate Spade sunglasses. Spring was good on them. Yeah, that's good. How do I look? Not my, not my shape. I don't know. So let's see if the battery is scratching. I don't see any scratching. It's got the tortoise shell frame. It says Kate Spade, New York. Yvette's and a number. So yeah, those are good. It comes with a Kate Spade cleaning cloth. and a dirty but cleanable case. Pink and orange and case fade. Yeah. All right. Very nice. So now I have another pair of case fade. I have more than that. I actually got, <laughs> I actually got the one of the, oh, it's not sitting right for me. I got one of the shipments from my back stock order today, which I'll probably do later tonight because I need to check it against my inventory because apparently I have five different tracking numbers. I got one box today 
So I'll have to check and see what came, what didn't come, what's missing, what's not. But it's here also. So I'll be doing another video on that. And I know, I'm pretty sure I bought a couple different styles of Kate Spade brand new uh, sunglasses. So I'll show you those. So I'm happy with that. Okay, so Kate Spade. Another uh, Kate Spade crossbody. And this beautiful silver metallic Michael Kors. I do like this. And I sure hope I can get these couple little spots off because it's that's a pretty substantial purse handbag purse handbag and then this Rebecca Mankoff which is very also very heavy camel color not a whole lot needed for that but you know I still clean all my linings whether they look clean um, I still completely clean them so that they're fresh um, because that's how I would want to get them. And then we have this other Kate Spade clutch with the bow. This is just adorable. I can't believe it took me that long to figure it out. If you just lift this side up and it opens. It's a nice clutch. And I'm sure I can get that out. Yeah. Looks like it's just uh, like syrup from a soda maybe. All right, nice. Yeah, I'm happy with this box too. The jewelry I'm happy with. I didn't sound happy on it. I apologize. I was just running 100 miles to nothing. Um, but I got some really good pieces, I think, in that box. So um, I got some junk, but I got some nice pieces that will make up for it. So I'm happy. All right. So Lily is back. I'm in a better mood, and I'll be in a better mood when I unbox the other one and see see what I got coming and anxious to get them listed but probably will not get them listed tonight because I need to finish um, some of the soaps that I'm making for the uh, that I do every year for a fundraiser so I've been working on that and I need to get some of that done tonight before I list but yeah I never know I tend to work um, half the night anyway so we'll see about that. But yeah, great box, Georgia, Swanee, Georgia. This and the jewelry box came from Swanee, Georgia. I have others coming. Most all of them are coming from Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania, except for one designer box is coming from Arizona. And everything's been shipped, so um, over the next week, there's always going to be probably something that I can put up for you guys. And I appreciate you watching. Thank you for coming. Thank you for commenting. Um, I've been trying really hard to keep up with the comments. I'm sure I've missed a few, but I'll probably go back to them, uh, you know, the ones that I've missed and at least give you a heart or something. I know that's not enough for you taking your time out, but I'll get to it, I promise. Um, so anyway, great box. I'm happy. More to list, more to sell, and I hope everyone has a great sales week, and I will talk to you soon. Early out.